Hi guys, this is Rack and Load and what have we got here? <gasps> CZ Scorpions. Oh yeah, it's range time. Now this one is actually a prototype, kindly on loan from Cotswold Classic Arms. Unfortunately, we can't use this one though because uh, we broke, well we didn't break it, but it was broke um, in transit, the site was, uh, en route to the rat cave, unfortunately. What a shame, what a shame. Yeah, I could swap it out and use another one, but I thought, oh, do you know what? Save getting two guns dirty. Um, we'll just use the production version, which is this. And we're gonna have some fun, guys. We're gonna have some fun with them. Got a steel gong uh, set up uh, just over there. Well, got loads of gongs actually, but I think I'm just gonna hit my one that's over there. And uh, let's see how these things perform. I think they're gonna be pretty cool. I really, really do. They are, well, they're just, they are cool. They're cool, just the feel of them and the look of them is just, I don't know, it's just retro cool, but let's see how they run. That is seriously, seriously good fun. Oh my God, serious fun. <laughs> this thing is making me smile. Oh my God. CCI mini mags.
I am in love. Oh my god, I am in love. This thing is so cool. Oh my days. Look at that thing. <laughs> Alright, it's not the most, I don't know, um, ergonomic, but oh, fun factor. Do you know what? I'd have one of these over a long barrel pistol. Con well, sort of um, conventional pistol any day. Way more fun. Way more fun. I need to load mags. I need to seriously load more mags. So I've got subsonic and supersonic ammo in there, all mixed up, one after the other. As you can see, SK standards, CCI mini mags. So sort of just alternating sort of uh, standard velocity and high velocity. Uh, just see how it runs, you know. It's pretty damn reliable so far. Uh, I've put about, oh God, 200 rounds through it so far. It's just eating them. Oh, this thing is so cool. I'm, I am loving it. I am loving it. Right, and so it'll be a standard first and then a high, high velocity and then it'll sort of just alternate like that. Oh, actually, there might be a few standards in there. Only got about five rounds left. There is actually a spent bit of brass rattling round in there. <laughs> I'll have to strip it down, and just get it out, but that's probably the only little issue you get with these guns is because. Everything's kind of, the internals are, a, you know, a sort of internal, if that makes sense. So you can't sort of, like, like on a conventional, like semi-auto uh, long barrel pistol, for example, you can't just pull the slide all the way back and then there's no sort of nooks and crannies where it can get in. But with this, there is. But do you know what? I don't care. It is so cool. I just don't care. It's got an empty case in it and it's still working. I've got to get that spent case out, but it's still running. <laughs> how many, how many guns do you know? 
that had got a spent case rattling round inside them, just carrying on working. Caesar, baby, Caesar. That is so cool.